Subcutaneous injections can be administered at home to provide the patient with any medication necessary. Generally, you have a volume drawn up into your syringe. You want to replace your needle, so removing the needle and replacing it with a fresh one. Nicer for the patient. Again, exactly like the subcutaneous fluids, we're going to tent up the skin on the back of the neck. The only difference is we are going to aspirate to assure that we have not hit a vessel. So, tent up your skin, puncture your needle in through the skin, pull back on your needle, assuring there's no blood in this hub, and then administer your injection. And that's it.